Honolulu's annual So'olay Day for Memorial Day is back and celebrating 72 years of paying homage to veterans laid to rest at the National Memorial Cemetery of the Pacific. Kaju Forrest, Aaron Coogan joins us live from Kilauea District Park. And Aaron, this is a major undertaking. How many lay need to be sewn for Monday and how many have you made already this morning? <laughs> yeah, hey, good morning, Julia. Well, I've made one, one of 38,000 that are needed to adorn all of the, the headstones at the Punchbowl Memorial. So a tangible way for you to contribute this Memorial Day. It's the reason I'm joined by Nate Zerota this morning. Thank you so much. This is my second year and the 72nd year that we're celebrating for the city. Yes, you know, thank you for joining us again. Thank you for making the lay for Memorial oh, yeah. Day. Yeah, as you mentioned, we need one for every one of the 38,000 graves at Punchbowl. You know, it's a reminder of how many have sacrificed for our betterment, um, but really we invite as many people as possible. If you can come make it down, we've got 17 sites around Oahu. Uh, Kilauea District Park right behind us is one of them. Honolulu Hale, Waiau District Park, you know, Waianae District Park, really all over the island. We have them listed online. Um, you don't have to have any lane making experience. You come down, uh, we, we provide the flowers, we provide the needles and the, the string, and it's really simple. Just put it right in, you know, make a, a lay that's, you know, it doesn't have to be a full size lay. You know, a typical neck lay will be about 36 inches untied. Um, this is about 20 to 22 inches untied uh, 10 to 11 inches right here when it's tied you know uh, we're looking at you know you know 38,000 lays so we're trying to maximize all the flour mm -hmm. and a pool that we have to make for these lay this is a huge undertaking uh, a community call to action right but I want to talk about the historic significance the tradition uh, that you guys have started and and the commitment that you guys make every single year absolutely you know we, we take great pride working with the various organizations uh, to not only make these 38,000 lay and adore in every grave uh, the, the scouts of Hawaii are the ones are going to be placing the lay and American flag on all those gravestones. Um, the U.S. Veterans Affairs Office is the ones who run Punchbowl, so they host the, the events and, you know, all the military organizations that help us as well, too. Uh, you know, it's a, it's a big undertaking, but we're proud to work with all the different organizations and, you know, proud to help facilitate this uh, this ceremony that helps mark you know memorial day it really is a beautiful thing to see when it's all in fruition and and that's what folks are going to be able to see if they go to the uh the ceremony on monday you know it is it's it's a beautiful but also sombering sight mm -hmm. to see to you know realize how many people have sacrificed you know in, in every in conflicts and in service to the country um, i do want to also um, suggest also you don't have to come to the soleil sites today um, if you have flowers if you have crown flowers or plumeria you can drop those off at the sites as well too um, and if you have pre made lay, uh, particularly any lay left over from graduations, you can drop them off at any fire station today. That's Federal Fire Station or Honolulu Fire Department Station from 8 o'clock to 6 o'clock today. Uh, just drop them off there make sure there's a firefighter there and uh, add to the lay and put it on one gravestone. Well, a lot of work to go before, uh, before Monday. You can make your part going to one of those 17 sites across Oahu. And for more information, you can visit our website at kiatv.com. For now, reporting live, Aaron Coogan, kiatv4, Island News.